Hi, I'm Claire from The Kitschy Kitchen, and this is 10 Second Living, where I show you how to do practically anything in 10 seconds or less. And today, I'm gonna show you how to put together salsa fresca, and I love salsa fresca. It's a really simple, classic recipe, and it's also really adaptable, which is why I like it. It's very versatile in the kitchen. And this is sort of a basic ingredient list for it. I have some tomatoes, about a quarter bunch of cilantro, half of a white onion, you can also do red onion, I have one lime, and then for heat, one jalapeno. And if you prefer any of these elements, you can just add a little bit more. Definitely make it to your palate. So, let's get started. Combine all of the ingredients in a medium-sized bowl. Taste and adjust seasoning. Let it sit for an hour for the flavors to combine. My salsa fresca is done. It looks fantastic. And the key to having really delicious salsa fresca is to let this stuff sit in the fridge for a couple of hours. You really want all of those flavors to come together. And what's fun here too is tomato is sort of the star of this salsa, but if you just got rid of the tomato and replaced it with cucumber or mango or pineapple, you'd have an entirely different salsa, but a really fabulous flavor. So this is a really great base recipe to adapt a million different ways. So I'm gonna give it a try. Mmm, that is so fresh. I love the combinations of flavors here. And you probably noticed I didn't just use cilantro leaves, I actually used the stems too. And that's because the stems have a lot of really fabulous flavor and a really nice crisp texture. For more recipes like this one, check out my blog, thekitchykitchen.com.